Mobile could once again be in contention to build a new refueling tanker for the U.S. Air Force. More than a decade ago, an Air Force contract was awarded to a company that would build would, that would have built new tankers in Mobile. When that contract was lost to Boeing, or, but that contract was lost to Boeing. As Bill Riles reports, the Air Force is now looking to build another refueling tanker, and Airbus says it will be in the running. The Air Force is calling for a new refueling tanker as a bridge between the troubled KC-46 tanker built by Boeing and the Eisenhower-era KC-135 tanker. Some city leaders remember the time that thrust Mobile into the Air Force tanker competition more than a decade ago. At stake, a $40 billion contract for a new Air Force refueling tanker that Airbus promised to build in Mobile. I remember when we were awarded the contract, and then I remember what happened when we lost the contract. So At the time, it was a bitter pill for state and local leaders to swallow. Sam Jones was mayor at the time. It's devastating to win a $40 billion contract one year, and then the next year be put in a position where you can't compete. There were charges of political shenanigans that left Boeing the winner of the tanker competition, now building the Air Force's newest tanker, the KC-46 Pegasus, an aircraft that the Air Force admits is a lemon particularly the remote viewing system that allows the boom operator to see the aircraft being refueled. Now, of course, Airbus is successfully building commercial airliners at Brooklyn Field instead of tankers. And now the temperature in Congress has changed that has some lawmakers calling for rebidding the tanker contract. And last week, the Air Force sent out a sources sought alert, asking to hear from companies interested, which may have had some heads at Boeing spinning. Airbus, which already has a tanker based on its A330 platform, said it would respond to the alert. While it doesn't guarantee Mobile would be in the mix if Airbus wins the competition this time, with two assembly lines in Mobile and the only ones Airbus has in the U.S., Brooklyn could once again be a good bet. And local leaders who remember the last time are thrilled to hear about it. Way to go with Airbus. Boeing having trouble with tankers. Boeing is having trouble with airplanes. We haven't heard anything like that from Airbus. Like I said, what goes around seems to eventually come back around, and we're thrilled. The Air Force is looking for 140 to 160 new tankers at a rate of 12 to 15 per year. Bill Riles, WKRG News 5.